Wow! Woo! Yes! Bring me an omelet, baby! What do you get when you hire a blue jay and a raccoon to work for you? Oh, God. <laughs> a regular show? Regular, regular show! show! <laughs> <laughs> All right, well, we are hanging with Mordecai, Rigby, Benson, and the whole regular show gang for a try not to eat that'll absolutely have you feeling ravenous. I'm gonna eat. This is gonna be hard. This is like one of my favorite shows ever. I'm always excited to try food, so <laughs> who am I kidding? <laughs> The Grill Em Up food truck is being credited with creating the world's best burger, the Ultimatum. The Ultimatum. Oh, I don't know how I feel about this. Oh, no. Oh, yes. <laughs> Oh man, that now that is a burger. One thing about Cartoon Network, they're gonna come up with something that's gonna give you cardiac arrest and or diabetes. Not if you try it one time. Anyone who doesn't eat one is a chump. Oh, oh my wow. god, how do you even take a bite of this? <laughs> Bro, this is just a It's just a burger, burger patty burger. It's burger patty burger. Straight from the grill em up truck, the ultimatum is a cheeseburger stuffed inside a cheeseburger with two cheeseburgers as buns. And if you don't eat it, then you're clearly a chump. And what about it? I'm so sorry. I'll take my chump with a capital C. Look at this burger. It's like the size of my head. <laughs> I'm gonna try and do it in one bite. Please it's don't. It's a whole thing, not the whole thing. Right. Wow. Wow! Wow! Oh, wow. <laughs> yep. It tastes like a big mouthful of ground beef. <laughs> I really like it. She did it! Mm. But that mess, mm -hmm. I could never. I feel like because I couldn't even like take a full bite of it, like I'm physically unable to, it just would have been torture. All right, well, are you passing? I'm passing. You're a chump! This isn't gonna be easy. Just stick to the training. You can do it. Oh my god, I remember this episode. See? Good luck. Thanks. I kinda wanna do mm. it. Are we being challenged? Bring me the omelet, baby! All for her. <laughs> but oh why are that? What does it entail? And what is in that <laughs> drink? Oh my gosh. The fruit looks really yummy. This excellent challenge is made with a dozen eggs, mushrooms, and peppers before being topped with chili cheese biscuits and served with a side of fruit. For the first person who tries. Oh, oh my god, oh, that's cute. Whoever eats first. <laughs> oh! Give me a hat. Sweet. I think Zarya got it. You're excellent. I am excellent, baby. Chewy. I'm excellent. All right, take your stupid hat. I don't want it anyways. Ruins my hair. All right, I'm glad. Let's go, guys. Stranger Things. What will you give me if I can do the entire omelet do that to in three minutes? Can I get a punishment card? <gasps> as good as it sounds, like I'm not even an egg person. This is good. Are you worried about the punishment? No. If I can eat not the whole meal, the mm, omelet. No, because In Mordecai did everything. I'm sorry. Okay. <laughs> three minutes, get out of punishment free card. The hat is backwards. On your marks, get set, eat! Three minutes on the clock. Sharon's tactic seems to be cutting and eating. The mouth has not stopped moving. The fork is forking. I feel like I'm eating it with her. Wow. There's a little bit. Yeah, there you go. With 21 seconds left on the clock, our girl Sharon did it and has won herself a punishment free card, meaning that she can enjoy the rest of the food as she pleases and I will have to sit here and not bask in the glory of getting the prize food. Yeah, buddy! I mean... I would be lying if I said I wasn't jealous, but that is well deserved. Oh, she finished this? Yes. Sharon's a beast. You're probably wondering why I brought you here today. Not really. All the richest people in history. Rigby's smart juice pickles. <laughs> no. What drinks granola? Frozen fruit punch concentrate. A dash of hot sauce. See, this one's not gonna be good though. So it just sounds horrible. Yeah. I don't think you should Rig juice! I'm scared. I'm already burping. That looks like toxin! It's a cartoon. It oh my lord. It is just like the real one. This is tempting, because this is a liquid, and I love me a good liquid. 
Don't you want your face to feel like magic after drinking a few swigs of rig juice? Wow, y'all are creative. Oh, whoa. You tried it already? Oh, yeah. Can okay, you do it first, please? Bottoms up, I'll rig juice. My face feels magical. Stop, is it? There's this like sweet, but then there's something in there that has a touch of a kick. Yo. Do you feel like magic? Yeah, that's not bad. You're not trying it? It's rig no, juice. No, it's not worth it. You know, like I'm gonna- It's rig like, juice. Like tasting this and trying this means that I have a third bite of whatever's bad in the end. And it just doesn't seem worth it. All right, so you're not trying the rig juice? I'm not. You don't this want your was, face to feel like magic? This was the hardest, I will say. Shout out to our team. But my will is a little too strong. You gonna try it? Oh my God, she did it. That was so gross. <laughs> Shut up. Get it away from me. All right, all right, all right. <laughs> okay. Mm, Death Kwon Do. You guys. Oh. <laughs> Honestly, this is impressive. Oh. Wow. Look at him go. How did he punch Three. meatballs into the sandwich? Because it's a cartoon. What's in this death sandwich? Do I want to know? You can't sue me. <laughs> If you don't eat it right, you die. There's a way to Ooh. eat the sandwich? Well, we're gonna find out. Praying for Sharon Erdogan. Oh my god, it is a really cute looking meatball sub though. Oh my god, this looks so yummy. Oh Hi. my god, you can't see, you guys are clever. I'm not eating it, but I still want to sign. We're not allowed to sue you guys, this goes wrong? That is not your signature, Danny. Oh my god. <laughs> Last time I checked, it was. <laughs> The flagship dish of Death Kwon Do. The death sandwich is an ancient recipe created thousands of years ago and will kill you if not eaten correctly. I don't remember how they have Yeah, I don't either. remember. Oh no! There she goes. I can see the green already. No! No! Oh. Wait, Danny, you gotta come back. There's uh, six stages before you die. Oh, six stages? Oh. Yeah. The first one, Face turns green and you start choking. Then your face feels like it's on fire. Your intestines melt away and leak out of your body. I don't see them. I don't see them. Where are my intestines? <laughs> then the victim screams in pain, but no one can hear them since they've lost their voice. Okay, Ariel. You get your voice back, but only to cry out in mercy in ancient forgotten dialects. You sound like a baby. And obviously, then they die. Oh my God. I kind of mm. just want to try it. Yeah? But I won't. Maybe we'll switch on this Because what one. if I don't first. eat it right and then I Ooh. die here? The uh, correct way to eat the sandwich is with a mullet and jorts. <laughs> Could never. So, Zaria, this is a pass for you? It's a pass for me. I don't have a mullet or, or jorts. Yeah, I mean, I, I, don't, I don't got the jorts or the mullet or the... <laughs> so, I think I'm gonna have to pass on this one. Those apple fritters were double glazed by mistake. Double glazed? We'll take them. Actually, I gotta throw them out, bro, because they're not safe for human consumption. Oh, that's not good. Like, this is triple glazed. Ooh! <laughs> Fresh from Candy's Donuts, we've got some accidentally double glazed apple fritters, and we'll let you decide if they're safe for human consumption. Oh, the glaze like goose. Oh, it's good. Mm -hmm. It looks good. Mm -hmm. She looks cute. Oh, you already. Oh, mm -hmm. you already started. Okay. Oh, all right. All right. I'll join you. Mm -hmm. Oh my God. Don't do that to Yo. me. How's that double glazed apple fritter? It's damn good. You don't know how bad I want to try this. I gotta win. I gotta win this thing. I'm, I'm so far. I can't throw it away. I respect it. Well, <sighs> that is our challenge. Congratulations, Janelle and Anthony. You were able to avoid some delicious dishes, and for that, we've got the ultimate challenge and prize. Damn. Yeah, 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 yeah. Do you like steak? Uh, I do I like, like good steak. The steak universe. Yeah!
If you and a friend can okay. our 96 ounce steak and eggs in under an hour, we'll give you <laughs> t-shirts that say raise the steak. This is what I waited for. A t-shirt. <laughs> for our winners, you get the chance to raise the stakes and win your very own t-shirt. Damn! <laughs> oh, oh, that's nice. Oh my god, that looks phenomenal. Wow. I'm so regular show now. What? Yes! This was worth this was worth it. I could get a shirt and a, a steak too if I wanted. I'm almost willing to take my chance on the. Uh, this is seasoned well. On the punishment. Unfortunately, Jeremiah, Sharon, Danny, and Zaria. That's us. You were tempted, and for that, you must suffer the consequences. Let's take a look. Something like that. Damn. I actually have to see what this is. Wings for real men? Wings, Wings for, for real, real men! Look at here. We got several fancy city folks. Oh, but no. no. <laughs> I need a bucket of wings to go. Free wings for life, huh? Our wing sauce is made from mutated ghost pepper. Ghost pepper. Mm. Ooh. Mutated ghost peppers? Ow. Oh my god. That looks painful. The bones are piling up. That's a cute cauldron. <sighs> Made from mutated ghost peppers, hot magma extracts, and black widow spider venom. We've got a plate of inferno chicken wings that uh, just might kill you. Nicole, this might be a little too intense. How many times am I dying this episode? I'm gonna just do the whole wing. Oh, that's hot. There it is. Is there a specific pepper? I don't know if it's like more spicy or- A like spicy this one, Zaria. <laughs> How are you feeling about your life choices, Sharon? I love it! I feel so alive right now! Okay, at the beginning it's not that bad, and at the end it's not that bad, but everything in between is like, oh my god. Ah! But this is painful. <sighs> the chicken's real good. That does it for today. Any final thoughts? I slayed. And I won. And I had spice. Uh, and I saw God twice. I feel really grateful. I have a steak, I got eggs, I got a shirt. Yeah, that is pretty fun. I really won. I really did win. Thank you guys so much for watching this episode of People vs. Food. What did you think of this Try Not To Eat challenge? Let us know. And let us know what else we should try down in the comments below. And as always, make sure to like and follow for more. Take a sip, yeah. <laughs>